Welcome back to Studio 10, friends. Thanks for joining us this morning. Children's of Alabama has provided specialized medical care for ill and injured children across the southern state since 1911. For the past three years, they've held regattas at the Fairhope Yacht Club to raise money for the hospital, and they're getting ready for another one. So you could watch lots of beautiful sailboats going as fast as the wind will take them this Saturday. Now, right now, you can see how our sailing lesson went. Now, this is what you call an awesome day at work, right? <laughs> Sailing. And we're doing all this because the big Children's Cup Regatta is coming up. And this is something we want everybody to get involved in, right, Carrie? Absolutely. It's actually next Saturday, um, well, this coming Saturday on the 17th. And it's right here at the Fairhope Yacht Club. And we'll have sailboat races all day. They start at noon. And then in the afternoon, we'll have kids' activities, a live band, um, great barbecue, and a really, really great silent auction. Now, this is not just because. There's a reason behind the regatta. Exactly. It benefits the Children's of Alabama Hospital. Um, over 1,800 kids just from the Gulf Coast were seen there last year, so it definitely has a local impact. And several of those kids are members of the Yacht Club. Um, Katie Hamlin was in a coma at our hospital for over seven months. Al Gorisco, he has had over 20 surgeries there, and they're all members here at Fairhub Yacht Club. So a lot of these members got together and just wanted to do something to give back. So this is a big deal. This is the fourth annual, annual Children's Cup Regatta, and it's open to the entire family. Anyone you want to bring. Exactly. If you're a sailor and you want to enter a boat, it's $25 for a youth and, and $50 for an adult boat. If you just want to come watch the races, there's no charge. You just load up the car and come on down, and we'll have great activities for the whole family all day. Now, speaking of entering a boat, I don't know, maybe I'll enter a boat. I've, I've never sailed before, but Eric, you're going to be teaching us how to sail, and we're going to try to try to avoid what is this called? The boom. Okay, first of all, I guess we have to learn what things are called, and we have to not get taken in by the ropes. <laughs> well, lines. The lines. <laughs> the main sheet. All right, they're not ropes. They're lines, and it's not a big bar. It's a boom. So I've already gotten strike two. I don't know that I'm going to be ready to sail by this weekend. What do you oh, think? Yeah, it's very easy to sail. You can do that. Anybody can sail. Take that line and put it in that little cleat. That keeps it from sliding back down this way. Now what we're doing here is we have, since the wind's coming straight at us, we have to tack. You have to go at angles to the wind. Are you racing this weekend? Yes. So are you going to show us how fast this baby can go? Oh yeah, we get out there in the bay. It's going to be fun. I had this boat rolled over 90 degrees. And oh good, that's fine. comforting. <laughs> well it is because we made it. I'm back. The that, boat is here. That is true. Here. Everybody came back, so we're, we're all right. Sailboaters like to go as fast as they can. Well, of course. <laughs> it's going to be a race this weekend. That's right. All right. Who's ready to steer? Let's do it. All right. I am going to attempt to not turn the sailboat over. To turn the boat, I just move it that much, and it's turning. And I move it back, and it's there. So it doesn't take a lot mm -hmm. of effort. To flip us? And it's not going to <laughs> You guys do not want me doing this. I'm telling you. All right, now the thing you want to do is pick out something on the horizon that you can see uh, and kind of head the boat toward it. Okay. I feel like it's going right, like way towards me. Pull it to you. Pull it towards, towards me? Yeah. Okay. Is there a certain way I need to hold on to it like this? I, mean, I usually hold them like that. Okay. You can just hold it like that where you can get some good pulling behind you. I feel like I'm going to top us over. I feel like you're no, so low. You Look where you're going. Okay. And relax. <laughs> Fly planes, drive boats. Oh, goodness. You're doing great. <laughs> the boat naturally tries to ground itself up. Okay. okay. So you want to keep it pulled to you. Okay. A little bit. You want to keep a little pressure. Okay. All right, boat, I got you. Why are you trying to fall? I, it just looks like it's going to fall over, and that's what scares me. <laughs> <laughs> it won't fall over. Another thing too, if you panic, you can turn loose the tiller uh -huh. and just hold on, and the boat will round itself up into the wind and sit upright. It'll make a lot of noise and everything, but it'll, if you panic, turn loose. Interesting. Yeah. And I'll show you if you want to do it. Just turn loose of it. Watch what happens. Oh my gosh! Okay, You'll be fine. Am I, is You'll it gonna hit fine. you? Okay. Just turn loose. One of your kids falls overboard. 
loose up. That's all you gotta do is turn them loose up. Now pull it to you a little bit. Okay. I gotta get back in the wind, right? Yeah. All right. All right. Back. There you go. See, you're already picking up some nautical turns. Learning. Turbs. Learning. Wait. It's not just make that noise, is it? That, that's just the sail. It's not as hard as I may have made it look. Maybe, you know, it just took me a little longer and it is a lot of fun. So again, you can go sailing or you can just watch the Children's Cup Regatta set sail this Saturday, August 17th, and it's going to be at the Fairhope Yacht Club. The races start at 1230 and everyone is welcome to watch free of charge. Now from three to six, your kiddos can enjoy arts, crafts, a water slide, and games in under the sea. It's a huge activity area. Then at seven, awards will be handed out, followed by music, food, and drinks, and also a silent auction. And again, it all helps children of Alabama. So mark your calendar.